security guards that were at the front door of the club and the dispensary. I tell my students every day we are more than the damn nannies. More than someone as custodian. Way more than a janitor. I tell my beautiful students every day that we are Professor Xavier's for the school of the young, the black and the brown, and the gifted. We understand that royalty can. We understand royalty can. I understand royalty from San Francisco can shift to survive in certain spaces. Because I'm most certainly code switch uh -huh. yeah. on a daily basis. Yeah. I night crawl through my city, my city of San Francisco, feeling like one, looking like only. Eyes bulging, mouth twisted, head bent, trying to extend the olive branch. I am strange fruit in my own goddamn city of American dreams. Yeah. Alex yeah. Nieto. Yeah. Say his name. Mario Woods. Say his name. Oscar Grant. Trevor Martin. Sandra Bland. Michael Brown. Eric Gardner. Emmett Till. Nia Wilson. How many more names? Say their names. Do they even know their names? How many of them were no angels, but I can't help but feel melancholy. Some of us are treated like problems before we evaluate as people. It was a long shot. I mean, ask my high school counselor. It was a long shot. I would ever get my high school diploma. So if I'm a take a last stand, Oakland, I'm a need first class. Yeah. I'm a lover, not a fighter. I really am. But when society gets to treating my people like mutants, grab the hammer by any means necessary. necessary. Oh. I have a and no matter how many times this country tries to bury us, they forget too often that we are the seeds coming out of the ashes, yelling our shame. We are the phoenix rising in numbers. Look around the room. We are the phoenix rising in temperature. Pyro, I marvel at the fact we've been able to control all this fire without it burning us alive. It shall be useful in lighting the torches of thousands. The melting pot is tipping. These are the days of future past. We are being hunted. We are being captured. And if we are not careful, every day we are being killed by sentinels. 20 years from today, you ask yourself, you ask yourself, you ask, everybody look in the mirror and ask yourself, what did you do? When families are being separated and our children were being locked in cages, what did you do? Legend has it some Black Panthers went through that eye asking for one favor a day. If you exist up there, please don't let my daughter go through that. I hope she never loses her mystique or questions her place in the universe. Instead, as the world burns around her, may she airbrush her dreams with its embers. I'm only five foot ten, but I play a rather colossus role in her life. So I ingrain the greatest superpower she'll ever have comes from her cerebro. And when fully operational, just like my beautiful students, she has the ability to elevate above tyranny and intolerance, but understand, as an Afro-Latino, if I were ever just to storm out of a life, that it might cause an apocalypse. Inciting all forms of meteorological temps, I'm talking blizzards, I'm talking toxic fog, I'm talking tornadoes. My daughter, she gets long-winded whenever I'm about to leave the house. Cause she knows that six years old, when her father walks out of those doors every morning, she might not ever see me again. So I wake up every day in beast mode. Yes. A manifestation yes. of political activist and freedom fighter. Yes. Get a good fucking look. These veins that pump revolution. Yes. Yes. In the size of my oppressor, if walls in America are built, that's fine. I shall raise offspring who know exactly how to juggernaut right through them. We are the children of the Adam. This is the school of brotherly love. And where I come from in the Mission District of San Francisco, black and this brown is indestructible. 
And even on my nappiest hair day. Yes. Hella goddamn beautiful. Hell and the last time that I checked, my people have been buried alive and left for dead. Yet we found a way to get up out those ashes just off our shoulder. Because we too sing America. And when life gives you ice, you crush it. Hey. Thank you.